Hello dear friends, this is Hello Hollywood, that means you're in for some exciting news. Let's get started. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are allegedly constantly at war and trying to determine their true identities, royal experts claim. This ongoing battle for control of their relationship and public persona has reportedly created tension and confusion about their motives and future. Royal columnist Kinsey Schofield recently noted the tension with which the couple met their six-year wedding anniversary. They've created this us-against-the-world relationship, but the constant stress and litigation, as shown in their Netflix documentary, suggests they rarely find moments of peace. It feels like they're constantly fighting someone or something. When do they get a chance to catch their breath? Schofield's observations were echoed by fellow royal watcher Rupert Bell, who believes the Sussexes need to put the past behind them and move forward. Bell argued that Harry and Meghan must decide what they truly want to be. They are no longer working royals but are now a commercial entity. They should be clear about their motives even if they include philanthropic efforts. Their constant negativity about their past life only adds to the confusion. Bell also emphasized the couple's desire to control the narrative around their lives. This need for control was a major reason for their departure from the royal family. They wanted everything to be on their terms which wasn't possible within the royal framework, he explained. Despite the ongoing tensions, there are signs that Harry might still be welcomed back into the royal fold, at least temporarily. Ingrid Seward, a royal expert, mentioned that Harry, Meghan and their children Archie and Lilibet are likely to be invited to Balmoral this summer. The royal family traditionally spends August together at Balmoral and King Charles III continues to cherish this time. Despite the feud, there's no doubt that an invitation will be extended to Harry and his family. However, Seward pointed out that security concerns could hinder any potential reunion. Harry and Meghan's security fears might be a significant stumbling block, but it's almost certain they have been invited. The Sussexes' recent trip to Nigeria, which many saw as an attempt to position themselves as global figures, further emphasizes their desire for control. Their trip to Nigeria and others like it show that they still want to be seen as important figures. They want to feel recognized and respected, something they feel they lacked in the UK. As the couple navigate their new life, the question remains. Will they ever find the balance and peace they seek? Or will the desire for control continue to cloud their path? So there you have it dear friends, share this video and leave your comments. Bye!